Hey everybody, it's Tanya Atomic, and today this is today's mini review of the movie Muppets from Space, which was, uh, I can't remember the year it came out, but sometime I think in the late 90s. Um, but anyway, Muppets from Space is a movie featuring the Muppets, um, primarily Gonzo, who's one of my very favorite characters. Um, so Gonzo is getting transmissions from outer space about um, aliens that are going to land soon. I won't give anything away, but um, it gets him in trouble. It gets him noticed, all these things. And um, at the end, um, there's this big event that they all go to. The aliens say they're going to land and everything. But I'm not going to give anything away because that's the big important part of the movie. Um, anyway, Muppets from Space is cute. It's got a lot of the traditional Muppet humor that um, you are used to, that one would be used to if you are familiar with the Muppets. It has, um, there are some characters that are missing, like Rolf is missing, um, the band is missing, um, but it does have some of the newer characters in it. Um, it ha features the rats pr a lot, which is cute and fun. Um, and you know, you, you've got your, you've got Kermit and Miss Piggy and Fozzie, but the real focus of this particular movie is Gonzo. So if you love Gonzo like me, it's a, it's a fun kind of movie. But um, it did leave me with questions because I always thought Gonzo was a Kiwi. Um, I think I read somewhere that Gonzo was a Kiwi. I used to subscribe to Muppet Magazine, so I wonder if I read that Gonzo was a Kiwi in Muppet Magazine. I don't, no, I don't remember. If any of you out there know anything about this, um, let me know because this movie suggests that Gonzo is not, a, in fact, a Kiwi. So I'm very confused. Um, but anyway, uh, it's not as good as, to me, my personal preference is the, the Muppet movie, the first one. I just love that one. I think that one's really great. I love how it goes into the origin story of the Muppets. And I love how they used um, new technology that was never used before to show things that the Muppets were doing um, involving puppetry and special effects. And I thought that that movie is just like the, the perfect movie. And the newer one that um, had come out as well the kind of the newest one that came out a few years ago that one was really good too so this one is really cute and it's really fun it's definitely worth watching but i think that it's not as good as the original one but that one i think is kind of perfect you know i looked up the original muppet movie and it only gets like seven out of ten and like rotten tomatoes rates at 88 percent and i and i'm a little baffled but i'm like this is a muppet movie about the muppets and came out with all this new technology and it has these great songs and it's like kind of perfect movie for it's kind of a perfect movie to be a movie about the Muppets so I don't understand why the rating is so low it's a little bit crazy to me it's like if you're gonna make a movie of the Muppets it's gonna be this movie I mean this movie is like perfect for what it is so the seven rating is kind of weird to me it's like I think there's probably haters out there but you know when my movie Monas Returns was being made and we had um, an IMDB page and, a, and it was on letterbox and stuff people there were haters out there that were giving the movie one star and giving it bad reviews before we were even finished editing so there's no way that anyone even got a hold of like an early cut because it wasn't done yet so obviously there are people hating us just for what we were doing for making the movie in the first place um, and we got a lot of one stars and got a lot of bad reviews and those are mixed in now with the reviews that we're getting from actual views so it um, you know brings the movie down lower so I wonder if something like that's going on um, it's just weird it's just weird to me and it's weird that there are haters just hating and people out there just putting negativity out there I mean obviously they're very unhappy people and it's kind of sad um, but it does, you know, in a small extent, affect everybody else. So it's kind of weird. But anyway, just saying. <laughs> Went off on a tangent, but just saying. Um, yeah, there's haters out there that are just putting the hate out. And not it's not quite accurate in that way. So um, anyway, Muppets from Space. I love the Muppets. I love everything Muppet. So... 
I mean, how could I not like that? Especially being a Gonzo story. I think um, stories that go more into Gonzo, I'm gonna like. So obviously I liked it. Anyway, if you're a fan of the Muppets, just watch it. You'll like it. You'll find something to like out of it. It's cute. Okay, that's it for today's video. Thanks for watching.